hello guys and welcome back so now from this video onward we will start working on our player so adding player is fairly simple we can just drag and drop the player body in the environment and then just simply add simple movement to the player but it is not just movement our player should have gravity our player should jump drag our player should have in air movement it can handle slopes steps it can do sprint and crouching and also our player should interact with the physics objects so some of these are easier with the character controller approach and some with the rigid body for example in the character controller component it can handle steps slopes it doesn't stuck on walls and it is also easy to make snappy and the rigid body component comes with a built-in gravity drag and it also interacts with physics objects so we need a player that knows that if he is on the ground or in the air and also we want our player to just doesn't get stuck on walls so as you know from my past projects we use the character controller component because it is a lot more easier in the character controller component but as you know that the character controller component doesn't interact with physics objects but there are a lot different ways to get around that okay so now we will create a player which has movement which has gravity ground checking and jumping in air movement steps slopes and also we will make sure that our player doesn't get stuck on walls or you can say it need to be snappy so before doing anything let's just simply choose our character and add that inside our environment here are some different options okay so we will use this body pipe so just simply drag and drop this inside the environment here it is let's reset the transform of the body pipe let's drag and drop the body pipe right here okay as you can see here it is now let's click on that and prefab unpack completely now let's right click and right here select this create empty parent and let's name this as player then click on body 5 let's just simply copy this component from there and paste the component as new on the player which is the parent game object of the body and remove the animator from the body 5 now if we check the simulator here it is okay now what we will do is to simply move the camera right there okay it looks good as you can see let's focus up on our player let's actually move the player to the ground like that and then let's just set the camera okay here is the camera let's just actually play the game and see how does it looks okay it looks good let's for now change this to the game mode okay and check it out on the game mode okay everything seems fine let's move the player manually to somewhere right there okay let's move and down below and let's actually move the camera towards the player as well okay it looks good so as you can see our player is set up and now in the next video we will add basic movement to our player but before that we need to add the cinema machine so catch you guys in the next video